they are coming. What's up, Money Geeks, Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, I want us to take a look again at NEO. Uh, remember last, uh, I think two weeks ago, we actually did a video here on the channel where uh, NEO got this really good bullish rating uh, from analysts over at JP Morgan. And so they actually set a price target of $40. So we did a video cover that here and NEO has not stopped. Again, today some good news came out. They've actually set another critical milestone, which is incredible. Uh, so we're gonna take a look at that, read the news, and see uh, what you know, this is really all about. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we'll talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. And also, if you're looking to get started with investing, uh, Weibo currently has updated a uh, uh, promotion where if you sign up and deposit a hundred dollars you get three free stock not one not two three um i think this is going to go through the end of october so definitely go check them out so um yeah neo again i'm bullish on neo uh, because i see what they're doing i look at the underlying uh business model i look at their product i think this is a great company um but there's still some people that are skeptical but now i'm starting to see more and more wall street banks like really giving a bullish uh you know thumbs up to neo which to me that's good if you are uh, a new investor and if you haven't already if you're not even invested in neo then this might not really apply to you but if you have neo to me this is a buy and hold i'm not selling any bit of my neo stock so um let's jump right in kind of take a look at what this new milestone is and how i think this is going to change uh, Neo and the direction that they're going and it, mind you this is really really tough times for businesses across the globe uh, with you know we have the pandemic going on we have shutdowns in like lockdowns but yet you still see a company that is thriving through this so uh i just bet to ask the question like what if things were going normal what if the economies were booming as expected um again you have china and the us with trade walls going back and forth uh what if things settled down and we go back to doing business as uh was supposed to or we used to i think neo is up to a good run and i've actually seen somebody predicted that they, they seen the stock go all the way to 300 dollars I'm not gonna put that past them because look at Tesla. When it started, nobody saw Tesla going um, all the way to as far as $2,500 before the split. So I'm not gonna put that past uh, Neo. $300 might not be a stretch in, in this case. So let's jump right in, read the news, and then uh, we'll go from there. So again, this is, um, I'm just reading this from uh, um, investors.com. This is the huge news. So Neo hit a big milestone as Wall Street sees strong EV leader in the making. Again, this is Wall Street. So these guys are, they don't go out and endorse or talk about a company like this if they haven't done their homework. So um, again, like I, thought, I said, two weeks ago, it was JP Morgan, and then now it's Morgan Stanley. Um, now they're being bullish on the stock. And here is the critical news that I really want to share with you guys. And that's the main reason why I'm doing this video. So Neo, um, 5,000 electric vehicle of the month row of the production line. So here's the thing. This is not 5,000 vehicles in the lifetime of the company. 5,000 electric vehicle of the month. So for the month of October, they have, they've actually rolled out 5,000 vehicles. This is, I mean, like this is on believable if you i mean if you know the space you know how uh these companies are just getting their feet wet and neo is trying to do these kind of numbers five thousand a month um i mean if you start averaging that across a whole year man this company is gonna be um yeah they're gonna be something else and this is the reason why again i'm gonna go back to why i am so bullish on this uh, particular company the fact that they are thriving uh during these really uh tough times during the pandemic people are locked inside people are not going about their business as normal people have lost their jobs there's a lot of things there's a trade war between the us and china there's a lot of things that are going on but yet this company just keep pounding it and killing it or oh, to me that is 
awesome. So again, the fact that they're rolling a 5,000 units per month, that is huge, guys. And if you're not invested in this stock, I'll say go take a look, read about them, and see. Uh, maybe this could be one of the EV stocks. If you're not, if you don't have Tesla, this might be the next the next guy uh, in line that you can actually go after. Because remember, this stock ran from like three dollars and fifty cents, and now it's trading at let's let's pull up Yahoo. Uh, Finance here. So it's now trading at $31.77. And two weeks ago, when we when we talked about this uh, stock here on the channel, where I said analysts at JP Morgan had actually uh, you know projected that the price is gonna hit about $40, it was trading at $28 at that point. So uh, between two weeks ago, this thing is up $3 already and it keeps moving up which to me, that is awesome. Um, so let's go back here again. Again, guys, they, they're talking about in China where there's huge competition. It's not like Neo is the only um, EV manufacturer in China. There's other companies that are actually there doing well. So we're talking companies like Li Auto. Um, if you don't know them, go check them out. I did a video here about them. Um, yeah, we talk about Zepeng models. I mean, these are the companies in China that are, are you know, they're solid in, in their own in their own way. Um, but now they are looking more and more at uh, Tesla and looking at Neo as whole. This might be the Tesla of China. Uh, Tesla has, uh, you know, a presence in China. Uh, I think the model Y it's manufactured. They have a manufacturing plant in in China, uh, but Neo boy. They have stuff and here. This is another good thing that I actually read about too. So they have uh, the Neo EC6 electric coupe uh, SUV. So this one is going to be coming out pretty soon. This is an SUV um, and you talk about potential driver to the Model Y uh, for Tesla. So um, I think Neo is positioning itself for some really, really, um, you know, good growth in the future. So I'm super excited. I still own the stock. I, I, I mean, if I have the chance, I'm going to keep adding to my position gradually. Um, I got, like I told you guys here, I added um, when you get to, we got to nine dollars. I did at eleven. I did at fourteen. I did at twenty some. At twenty one. Um, I think I even bought a little a, a bit at twenty seven. And now, I mean, once I get extra cash. I'm gonna pump it in there and just keep building it um, as we go. So this is yeah, this is definitely good news. Again, look at where the, tr the stock is trading today. Which to me, um, if you if you were day trading it, you probably would have made an easy. Uh, if you, I mean that's what three dollars or four dollars a share today, which is good. Um, but for long-term investors, it's buy and hold and and watch it go. So as you can see, guys, Neo has actually positioned itself um, to be a power player in China. Uh, I mean, they're talking about competing with the likes of Tesla in China. In the Chinese market, again, I keep going back there, it's a huge market, over a billion people. Uh, the economy is doing well. I mean, not right now because of the COVID, but when you look at the numbers that NIO is doing, 5,000 cars in the month, uh, you know, leaving their production line, that is uh, unbelievable. And that simply tells us, like, hey, if things go back to normal, people get their jobs back, the economy gets back to normal, set rolling, that number could easily double. They could be rolling out 10,000 cars a month, which is um, for, I mean, for an EV car, that is good news. And they have a huge backlog of orders that people are waiting to get some of the cars. So that is what I'm seeing. That is why I'm loving this stock right now. Let me know in the comment section, what do you see your price target for Neo in the next year? Let me know in the comment section. Again, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. And also, if you're looking to get started with investing, guys, Weibo right now is doing a promotion where if you sign up, deposit $100, they give you not one, not to three free stock. The value is somewhere between $8 and $1,600. So definitely take advantage of these links in the description below. And as always, guys, don't be a greedy savage and stay motivated.